It's a dude on the cell phone. What? It's oh a God. dude on the cell phone. <laughs> okay, I didn't know if it was like a deeper joke to it, but all right, let's get into the match. I'll tell you the joke later. All right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, so Lucas Pikachu. I'm very impressed with this character being showcased so, on the stream. WebJP has won the last uh, three like local Wi-Fi tournaments for Tri-State. <laughs> Curly, so, like, he's number one in Tri-State. <laughs> Thank number one PR in Tri-State. <laughs> no, but like he actually has like a really everybody. solid like movement. He does really well in a lot of matchups. You'd expect him to have a tough time with. Yeah. So like I don't actually doubt that he could take it again today. Cool. I'm very glad to see a player like WebJP show up into the scene and just start like blowing people up here with his character. That no one like expect to see. People like, don't no, like no one was talking about Lucas. <laughs> People don't like Lucas, bro. It's like yo, you don't remember that whole time we were like, yeah, Lucas is banned in New Jersey. Yeah. It's over. <laughs> oh, he's banned in MTBA too. Yeah. <laughs> <He's banned. laughs> nobody wants to. Oh, nobody likes man. Lucas because he's annoying. You like, said whole... uh, like half the cast, but yeah. <laughs> I mean, like his whole kit is like really built around being like super evasive. Um, and also like just getting like these crazy long strings like he'll go he'll kind of fish for first starter And then once he gets it, he can do a lot of damage And he has like he can kill you from literally any part of the stage you don't want to do that. Yeah, and also has some decent anti-zoning too with that reflector mm -hmm. uh, Smashes that reflect and uh, the absorption Yeah, magnets really good magnet. Yeah And those shirts doing actually a great job of keeping it even has an easy two frame option with that down smash and the uh, tether. Like, that's, that was that's like signs of a great character right there. And to see it being like shown to us right now is pretty amazing. Yeah, this is the part where uh, Mousetrap's got to try to get that kill and it's not going to be easy. But a <laughs> nice, uh, nice, well, uh, nice, 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 Sometimes they just jump in the way. <laughs> yeah, sometimes <laughs> they just press forward too much. Yeah. Uh, WebJP is a very adaptive player from the matches I've seen him play. Able to reverse sets in his favor. Every, able to download players as easily. So, if he does a match and lose this game, he will definitely bring it back and we'll see a whole different like style of play from him. So, right now, uh, WebJP is playing a little bit of neutral here with uh, Pikachu. Trying to like find little gaps in here just to. Uh, Get Pikachu to mess up to hit him. Still very hard because Pikachu is a very small character. Likewise, he is too. But once the hits come in, um, the combo should come with that too. So yeah, it's both combo characters that just like getting started on the other one is gonna be. So oh, tough. that was that was rough. Oh, it's a tough time attacking that. Yeah, is like it pushed them all the way down there. <laughs> it was very rough for us to try to get out of. Despite the character's amazing recovery. Battlefield has a very huge gap below it. So like if you like even with like the best of recoveries in this game, like if you mess up down there, you're gonna die. Mm-hmm. It also means that even if you miss attack uh, near the bottom of the stage, there's still a strong chance you can come back mm. your character recovery is good enough. Miss the edge guard there. Oh my Ooh. god. Oh, wow, that sent itself. <laughs> that was that was something. That was, yeah, those was middle hits of uh, so. those middle hits of Pikachu's down smash like bring you towards Pikachu specifically. Uh, so it's very easy to just get like stage. Ooh, right what was that? <laughs> that was sick. <laughs> so they actually turned down the uh, the knockback on uh, Lucas's downer, so it doesn't start spiking like hard spiking yeah, as early in this game of... as it did like in Smash Four and Brawl. Oh, oh that's gonna be dead. dead. Ah, uh, yeah, he tried to match down the route of it too, just to hit him, but it just, it just missed. Yeah, and great awareness. Good. Yeah, great awareness from, um, from WebJP being like, okay, you just did like a really lagging move in front of me, and I actually have a kill throw. Uh, what are you doing? You gotta like chill out a little bit, bro. Come on. <laughs> that was an interesting first game right there. Like that definitely had like the weirdest kills I've seen today. 
Alright, this guy's time. Alright, game number two. Possibly. I doubt there's, there's gonna be a character switch because I don't know if Mouse Rat plays any other character in the web if he's definitely Lucas main. So we're gonna definitely probably see a stage. Maybe a stage. Maybe a stage. Oh no, no one left the arena, so I don't think a stage change is happening. Three, two, one, yeah, we're going straight back to battlefield, right? So. Okay, so that was good neutral error out of shield right there. Circuit your damage. Get these lightning loops. A little bit of neutral play right here. Sick combo from Web right now. Like he knows his character in and out. And when he's knocked away like that too, he's, he's able to set up a zoning game with that PK fire. Pretty good stuff. One of the big changes from Ultimate from Smash 4 for Lucas is that they made it so that his, uh, his PK freeze doesn't make him drop like a hammer. Oh, yeah, I remember that. That was so good. <laughs> yeah, so now he can actually use it to air stall by just like doing it from uh, far away. We can see him like, implementing that a lot. And the movement with the, with the tether snake, too, is pretty good, too. Using it as a confirmed tool when he's going in. Moving around, just moving around Pikachu here. This is a good low recovery. Oh my god, if that would have spiked, like, <laughs> that would have been terrible for Mouse Rat. Web is also doing a good job of making himself hard to grab. It's really important in this matchup because Pikachu does get, like, a, you can get potentially a huge amount of reward from grabbing you. Yeah. Uh, like way more than he would from just like hitting you normally with like the straight hits. Solid two piece confirms like knowing uh, when to give your easy damage when you can. Forwarder from Mouse Rat taking the first stock. And we're back at the neutral. Oof. That was a cool choice of a B right there to get a quick hit in. Uh, does Lucas uh, down B still like hit like after he does the? Uh... Yeah, it okay. hits on release. Oh, it hits on release. Okay. Yeah, but now Ness's is way better because it has like a little hitbox on it on both sides. And you can oh yeah, Ness is ridiculous. Yeah. You get so much off of Ness's now. I always like thought about like when those two characters like had those like little differences on, on their down Bs. I was thinking like, man, Ness would be cool if he had this too. And lo and behold, now they both have it. <laughs> Oh, that a B? Not gonna take. Not gonna take it yet. Close though. Close. Now sweating very dangerous percentage territory. Ooh, nice use of that B reverse uh, down B just to hit him with that. That's pretty sick. I'm liking that. The movement here from White to JP. Uh, it looks like a little too slow to try to edge guard Pikachu with, but I respect the, the attempt there from Web to use the up B. This is trying to clip the recovery. Oh! Almost a confirm from Mouse Fighter there with the falling up uh, forward there. Oh, <laughs> the big head <laughs> coming in. Yeah, the, the Mega Man coming to play again. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's the Brain Blast, right? Yeah, the up air. Huge. Stole from Ness himself. Ooh, could be a potential stock right there. You know, Strat's gotta be more careful. Uh, he's kind of in a really not great spot. He's gotta get this kill as quickly as possible. But because of the way that that uh, Pikachu operates, he's just gonna keep doing damage and not actually like finishing oh, that the hit. Yeah. It's too early, too early. See, um, it's very, it's also very hard for Pikachu to throw the drill here because of two options that Web has to, to block it. And that's oh, this is gonna be it. That was sick. That was pretty good, yeah. Until he took like 50 damage from that. 
Like the, the surrounding hits of Lucas's down airs. Really helping him out with these combos. On Pikachu, no less. It was pretty good. So yeah, uh, as an approach tool, the Thunder Jolt is not a good, probably not a, a good thing for Pikachu to use here. Just to try to, to hit web with or try to get in with because of the absorption from the down B and the PK fire to create the, the hitbox from, from the explosion of it. Just to have like a little miniature wall build up right there. Yeah, Web is in control of this stud right here, and this one confirms is going to take it. Nice Very combo nice. right there. Alright, so that's it for uh, WebJP versus Mousetrap. Also, hello, Dara. Hello, good. yeah. Um, is my is my audio okay? I, I hope it is. It's good. It's a little okay. tinny, but you should be good. Fantastic. Um, yeah, I just saw the end of WebJP and Mousetrap. Um, he took it over pretty convincingly. Um, and I just want to take a quick look at what's happening at the rest of bracket. In the Let's take a peek. Let's take a peek. Yeah. So we have all the other winners' matches still going. No reports yet. Another set right there is like 1 1 right now. Could be finishing soon in live versus Mag right there. Yeah, they're going to be. They opted to play off stream. So they'll be. Oh, okay. They'll be playing on their own time. And then we have Vivi versus Ralph with the after jump on the crowd. They agreed to, to wait. Okay, cool. So that means WebJP is going to be in winner semis. Yes. Yep. Um, we are waiting on 